Welcome to the Metaverse episode here. And in this one, we'll be talking about the Board Ape Yacht Club testing their Metaverse. We'll also be talking about Dubai, adding over 40,000 jobs to the Metaverse and investing over $4 billion. We'll also be talking about many other platforms that are integrating Metaverse into their platform. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and dive right in. All right, so as you can see, I'm using this avatar. I thought it'd be fitting for this Metaverse episode, but as you can see, the Board Ape Yacht Club is testing their other side Metaverse. And as you can see, people are just dropping in like crazy in this demo, literally raining from the sky um, as they fly into it, kind of that Fortnite vibe, jumping up and down as well. And you can see the giant ape in the background, but obviously this is a huge server load and you know they successfully tested that, this without really any much flaws and I thought this was incredible. Now the actual company that built this platform is actually called Improbable using one of their products I believe called Spatial. Um, I'm not an expert on that this subject matter, but DCL Manu Blogger on Twitter, I believe his uh, Twitter handle is, he did a whole write up on it, which is very interesting. Um, yeah, so this allows for projects like Basie to come in and utilize their, you know, system and build their own immersive experiences, as you can see here, kind of that Fortnite vibe with, you know, the stage and things like that with the, the live concert and things. This is kind of the direction I see where social, you know, is going to be popular in the metaverse. Um, obviously, so as I mentioned, 40,000 virtual jobs to be created by metaverse strategy announced by dubai so this is interesting um i'll link this article below so you can read a little bit about it but they are obviously super bullish on the metaverse and they have a whole strategy laying out on what that looks like for them and how they plan to add obviously thousands and tens of thousands of jobs into the metaverse so anyways i'll take a look here at spatial as well we're going to take a look quickly at kind of what spatial is and so you can have a little bit of back information about it Spatial OS is a cloud-based multiplayer platform for building and operating any online game. It lets you use any game engine to develop more efficiently, quickly, and creatively any game size. That's pretty interesting. That's kind of the synopsis. It's a, really a short video anyways, but I thought that was very interesting that you can build literally any game engine on this platform. So you got to be thinking in terms of like Unreal or maybe Unity is my guess. Like I said, I'm not an expert on this subject matter, but it is interesting to see where they're going and how other brands could utilize Spatial to build their own metaverses and experiences, which actually would be really cool considering that a lot of Web3 projects like Basie have integrated into the system and we could see some interoperability here, um, especially when it comes to platforms like BB, where maybe we could actually use our NFTs in a platform like this. So it does make me uh, beg the question of that. It makes me a little bit more bullish and excited about where the metaverse could go. Now, another platform I'm using is called Ready Player Me. Um, I built an avatar last year and they definitely didn't have this many integrations, so they definitely have upgraded big time. The avatar I'm using currently is what I built here on this app. Um, but as you can see, they integrate with Spatial, they have VR chat uh, integrations and many, many others. Somnium Space is a metaverse I told you guys about last year, which is, uh, you know, you can host parties and DJ and do all kinds of cool stuff in Somnium. Obviously, Spatial is a big one that a lot of Omi homies are using right now. You can see Portals is on the Solana blockchain and is a Solana metaverse. So this is really cool. You see a lot of different projects and Nemesis as well. I got a buddy that built a project in there. But yeah, you can see the VR chat, which is obviously probably one of the most well-known ones. There's Animes, which is a platform I'm using currently right now to do this video and many, many others. So these all have Web3 integrations, which is super cool. If we take a look at Spatial, we can come here and see integrations and take a a look at here but you notice the metamask wallet and even microsoft 365 and google drive and things like that they also have you know you can pair your headset download the app on your ios device and things like that and many other applications so this platform is really cool and this is one that the omi homies have been using but as you can see here we, let's just jump into one of these i was just in my uh, buddy's penthouse here in las vegas so I'll actually go into here where he actually had uh, art from the omi homie community Unity, as you can see right there. But yeah, let's go ahead and hop in his penthouse and load in. I'm using my current avatar that you can see here on the screen. And we're just gonna check out his space. You know, we're gonna go ahead and look around here. Um, he's got some art. You can even click on this and see all this. This is a JPEG, but you can integrate your NFTs. So you can lay out your NFTs here if they're on layer one Ethereum. And I believe it'll have like an open C link as well, which is really cool. But as you can see, we're just chilling here 
in Las Vegas. There's the, the city in the background. Uh, this is a very well done metaverse if you if I don't say so myself and you can actually come in here the the there was a fish tank right here. It looks like he's doing some work but the fish tank's really cool. It's like the graphics are pretty sweet. There's a cat, a cat right here. That's pretty funny. But yeah like this is a pretty well done. This loads pretty fast. Now I do have a pretty good gaming computer um, so yeah I have no issues loading anything in so I don't know what it's like on a you know lower end computer but let me know in the comments below if this works platform works well for you but this was really easy to get into I literally came over to spatial and created an account and made a avatar here in ready player me and integrated it and literally that was it so this is really exciting for me to hang out with people across the world and socialize so this is kind of where I see the metaverse going and spatial has done a really incredible job in doing this like I said I've been in a lot of different other metaverses like Somnium things like that I'll have to say that Spatial has done quite well here and it loads really quickly and I'm pretty impressed with that being said that's all I got for this video I hope you enjoyed smash the like button if you enjoyed this content and share it with a friend if you think this helped you learn more about the metaverse and turn on notifications so you don't miss any more videos like this but I'll see you in the next video at the metaverse and as always be like an NFT be authentic and I'll catch y'all later peace